Hey guys, welcome back to Fraser Focus, local faces and local places. Uh, it is our water themed episode. We are at Crescent Beach and we are ready to go sailing. There was uh, an active race team here for many years and then as uh, kids aged out and, and moved on to college and university, um, the team kind of died and now we've got uh, youth that are interested again and, and really excited about getting on the water to race. What's the best part about sailing? I like it when it's like just like nice calm days and you can just hang out on the boat and lay back and get some sun and stuff like that. It's kind of my favorite part of sailing, but racing is really fun too and just, I don't know, just being on the water is probably the best part. I grew up down here and then I, every like day just getting to come down here and be on the water and take out a boat is just so, it's just such a privilege and so nice. If you decide to tack, and that's when you uh, change directions. Yeah. Um, so the, the boom will swing around like you witnessed on the other boat. Uh, and then also you'll want to switch the jib sail as well. So then this will come along around and you'll want to pull it in on this side. Okay. Do you think I'm going to capsize? No, nah, you'll, you'll be fine. <laughs> you, you got a great skipper, so. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. You can duck your head. Oh gosh, whoa. Now do I pull the other way? Yeah, I'm gonna pull the other way. Oh my gosh, we're gonna fall in. No, you're okay. It's more accessible than most people would think. You don't, you don't need to spend a lot of money. Um, it's not crazy complicated. Uh, the basics are e easy to learn and then you can really go from there. So what's the trick to being the best sailor? Not worrying too much about, you know, a lot of stuff and just trying to focus on your own self-improvement. Most of sailing is just making the least amount of mistakes. That's the key to winning races, really. I think if anyone's gonna fall in the water, it's probably gonna be us. I uh, qualified to, for Youth Worlds represent Canada in a different type of boat and I'm representing Canada in China in cool. December. That's for all for sailing? For sailing, yeah. Yeah, so we qualified for that so we have to hand in our training plan and if that goes through then that's what we'll be doing in December. And how long have you been sailing? Um, I've been on sailboat since I was about six months old. <laughs> Basically, I my dad has a it's called a keel boat and it's a it's a bigger boat. Uh, they don't tip <laughs> over very easily. So, and then yeah, and I was down here on the beach one day and I, I when I was younger, probably about seven. And yeah, my dad was just like, oh, would you like to try that? And I started sailing here and then I took a course somewhere else and they're like, oh, you're actually pretty good. You should come race on our race team. How long have you been sailing? Uh, I've been sailing since I was eight. So for about 12 years. Yeah, and uh, I love been, it, man. Yeah, it's awesome. It's, it's a great time of job, and I can't ask for any better. It's uh, watch your head. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'll, keep, I'll keep a hand on that. So the program's going to run for three months, and we're hopefully going to do some inter-club racing with some of the other clubs in the Lower Mainland, and then take in some of the regattas on the BC race circuit. So if somebody sees this and they go, "Oh, I want to get involved in that," or, is it too late? Not if we still have spots open. We'll get them up to speed so they're at the same level as the rest of the team. And yeah. And there they go. They're on the water. We'll be right back here with Fraser Focus in a moment. Yeah. 